Middlebank Bank for since about 1987. Um, Midland Bank uh, are our current partners uh, in that venture. And uh, we've got about 960 students in school. 600 of those have got accounts. I, I think it's a work experience every day for those who work in the bank and those who actually access the services of the school bank. Around 10 years ago, when we first launched the scheme, we didn't even call it Midbank, we just called it The School Bank. Uh, and over time, uh, we've really got our act together and honed it down by listening to teachers, listening to pupils, uh, and we've taken it uh, to a situation where we think that we've offered something that we can truly describe as, as partnership in action. You're dealing with a large amount of money which makes you trustworthy and reliable, which may also help you in future careers. Get to know people and work with the money. You get a certificate at the end of the year that you can use to uh, apply for a college. I like working with large amounts of money. One of the things we try to do in school is to try and use all of the time as usefully as possible. It seems to me if we've got students who are operating as managers or counter clerks or banking assistants, that we ought at least to map their activities against the bank's accreditation processes. Roger Coxon threw the challenge down about six months ago. He said, my mid-bank uh, is an active, it's a real bank in every sense of purposes. We've had it for a number of years. Can you adapt your internal procedures so that we can use them at the school? The bank and the school have a great deal to learn in, in accreditation. Uh, the bank obviously knows what they're doing with their own staff. And uh, what we're asking them to do, uh, and we've formed a pilot to do this, is that they bring their processes, um, use them with our students, and see how it can be applied to the students in the school situation. And to help you go through that process, we've got three people from the Midland Bank to help you and give you advice on how to actually apply for the jobs and what to do uh, at interviews, and to tell you what you can get out of being a member of our mid-bank. Now, I'm going to talk about the statement of achievement. You're the first school out of 1,300 in the whole of England and Wales that are going to be piloted um, on this new venture. All pupils working in the school bank will be given a certificate backed up by the statement of achievement. This pilot scheme will be developed and introduced nationwide in 1993. Pupils were asked which job in the school bank they were going to apply for. I want to go for the branch manager job because you get to work with lots of people. I want to be the manager because um, so I can um, help other people and boost my confidence. I'm going for the branch manager job because I like to see boys and other people. I want to be assistant because you have some responsibility but not really a lot. After working for a year as manager of the school bank, Ameh Mohammed was given the opportunity to spend two weeks on work experience at the New Street branch in the centre of Birmingham. Good morning, can I help you? Good morning, I'm Amir Mohammed. I'm on work experience and I would like to see Kate Baker, please. Right, there's your pass one moment and I'll phone Kate for you. Thank you. Morning, Amir. Good morning. Welcome to New Street branch. Come on through. Thanks. We have quite a few people here who do work experience. And what we try to do is to give them a feeling for what banking is all about. Do you know much about banking? Yes, I'm involved in the school, school mid-bank. I'm, a, I'm a, actually a, a branch manager. Branch manager. It's quite a responsibility. Now, you're going to know a little bit about the we try to provide as broad an experience for them as possible so that they have the chance to see what it's actually like to work in a bank. They normally spend about two weeks with us, so they've got a chance to build up a level of experience that will make that possible. And generally, he has a chance to interact with people of all levels, right from the most junior up to the branch manager. Probably the biggest difference is that the people are not your age, and there are lots of unfamiliar characters that you have to get used to. Some are very talkative and uh, get involved with you. Usually, they're all hospitable. Uh, branch managers usually find and he looks after the staff very well. We would hope they'd enjoy it, that they would also go away with an idea of what really goes on in a bank rather than the stereotyped ideas which aren't anywhere near the truth. Uh, possibly that they'll have made a decision. Now whether that decision is that they don't want to work in a bank 
or that they do, it really makes no difference. If we've helped in that, then I think we've achieved quite, quite something. Probably I'll go on to further education college, university, and then probably think what career I should head to, and probably banking could be a future career for me. If we give the right sound advice to the pupil uh, when they're at school, when they leave school and go into their life, then hopefully Midland will be the first port of call for all ranges of financial advice. And secondly, and perhaps more importantly, is that over the years, we've found, as a bank, we've grown apart from our customers. We actually want to get back into the community, and we recognise that the school is the lifeblood of a community. When we form any sort of partnership with people outside the school, what we're looking for is that we, we look at what we, we, we need to get from them. But if you merely go to someone and say, give me this or give me that, uh, I think you're you're bound to fail. What we should be looking at is what the company has to offer, uh, what our needs are, what their needs are, and how can we both satisfy those needs. If we both make real positive gains out of it, then we're going to stay as partners, we're going to see it as valuable, we're going to see it as meaningful, and it will be continuous. It's the proper way to operate.